Well, hello. How are you? Everything good? Hello, teacher. All right. Great. Great. We're about to begin here in about right now. It's already eight o'clock. So we will begin. I hope everyone's well. Today is Friday, right? So today is the last day. And let me see. How's everyone? Everyone's good? Everyone's good. Everyone ready for review? Ah, Ramirez, <laughs> are you ready to do some review? Hoy es el día repaso. We're going to just go over some of the things and finish some of the pages que hacen falta en el manual, algunas más actividades, and some que he hecho para ustedes. Some that I have done for you. And you're going to also do some speaking in breakout rooms and create your own crear sus propias present continuous and tengo una actividad también pequeña short eh, comparando el present simple y el present continuous a ver si se acuerdan el present simple ya, ya voy a decir ya me olvidó right no 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 present simple right just a little comparison okay so let's Let's begin. The first thing that I'm going to do is, let me see, is get this attendance. So when I call your name, just please let me send that live. All right. Let me see. Marco, mando un mensaje. Teacher, voy a cambiar. En chat. Hay accidentes. Okay, just as long as you stay connected, uh, Marco. Nomás quedarte conectado. Okay, aquí veo que estás conectado. Gracias por informarme. Espero. All right, all right, teacher. All right. Thank you. I hope you make it home safe. All right. Okay. Let me Thank see. Thank you. All right. Adela Trinidad González. Déjame hacerme un lado aquí en la otra computadora. Ok, thank you. Adrian de Jesús Machado. Adrian de Jesús Machado. Ok, no hay respuesta. Alejandro Antonio Ramirez. Alejandro Antonio. Present teacher. Ok, thank you. Daniel Ernesto Márquez. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Gerardo Efraín Mejía. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Gustavo Alberto Montepec. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Jonathan Emanuel Franco. Present. Thank you. Jose Daniel Argueta. Jose Daniel Argueta. Okay, no answer. Jose David Rivera Aquino. Jose David Rivera Aquino. Okay, no answer. Jose Santiago Escobar. Jose Santiago Escobar. Present teacher. Okay. Juan Francisco Rodriguez. Present teacher. Thank you. Juan Jose Conrado. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Julio Cesar Merino González. Julio Cesar Merino. Okay, no answer. Marco David Velázquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Misael Rivera Aquino. Misael Rivera Aquino. Okay, no answer. Oscar Coreas. Oscar Edison Coreas. Okay, no answer. Oscar Ramirez. Present teacher. Thank you. And let me see. Rosa Lisette. Okay. 
Rosa Lisset. Ok, no answer. Victoria María. Present. Thank you. And Jessica Beatriz Fuentes. Jessica Beatriz Fuentes, ok. Una respuesta. All right. Great. Let me see. I know you're connecting the set. Sé que se está conectando ahí. All right. La miré. So. All right. All right. Let me see. We're going to continue. And we, what is today's date? Today is Friday, July 9th, 2021. Okay, very good. Déjeme. Déjeme cerrar la... Teacher, ya pasó lista. What happened? Ya pasó la lista. Sí, ya la pasé. Sí, ya la pasé, dice. Se me apagó un momento la otra computadora. Sí. La miré que estaba conectada antes que hiciera la lista. Entonces, sí, es que se me, se me trabó la otra, me tuve que venir para la otra computadora. Entonces, si yo veo que están conectados antes que yo pongo la lista, le pongo que sí, porque le mire que estaba conectada. Ok, ah, so okay. don't worry. Ok. Thank you. Al momento que veo la lista y no están aquí, entonces sí, no, no. Pero a usted sí la miré antes que pasara la lista. Okay. Estaba Thank conectada you. desde el inicio, desde las 8. Ok, no problem. Déjeme Thank cerrar you. la compu aquí para... Ok, para finalizar la lista de asistencia, ya. Yeah. Ok, let's begin. All right. Let me see. All right. Well, let me see. ¿Qué pasó? Dice, oh, ok, I thought you were saying something. All right. Yeah, escuché y pensé que quería decir algo, pero no. All right, all right. So, let's continue. Okay. And let me see. Well, first of all, I would like to say that, let me see, we're going to do review today. Oh, you had the other review. So, we are going to, why not? Terminé la programación hace, hace rato. All right, let me see. Okay. So we have here. We have here what we're going to do is review all right we're going to review a lot of the present continuous like i said earlier we are also going to review a little bit of the present simple just a little small part to compare okay negative question and affirmative in those areas but first let's let's begin with francisco hello francisco hello Michelle. all right welcome can you give us a topic please Russian continuous review. Okay. The date, please. Friday, July 9th, uh, 2021. Okay, very good, very good. Excellent, excellent. Let me see. Ramirez, the date, please. It says Friday, July 9th, 2021. Okay, very good. Conrado. Today is Friday, July 9th, 2021. Very good. Okay, Victoria. Friday, July 9th, 2021. Very good, excellent. Let me see. Lisette. Okay. Friday, July 
Friday, July 9, 2021. Very good. Gustavo. Friday, July 9, 2021. Very good. Excellent. Escobar. Ok, no hay respuesta. Trinidad. Teacher. Friday, July 9, 2021. Ok, repeat it, please. Friday, July 9, 2021. Ok, very good, Trinidad. Ok, Escobar. Friday, July 9, 2021. Very good, excellent. Let me see. Daniel Marquez. Today is Friday, July 9, 2021. Very good. Jonathan. Today is Friday, July 9, 2021. Very good. Jessica. Friday, July 9, 2021. Very good. Excellent. Efraín. Okay, so today is Friday, July 9, 2021. Okay, very good. Let me see. Alejandro. Okay, no hay respuesta. Um, Argueta. Ok, no hay respuesta. Ok, let's continue. Today is Friday, July 9th, 2021, or 2021, right? And as you can see, today is class number 15, and we are almost finished with the module. Next week will be the final week, and today is Friday, and then you can enjoy the weekend. I want to, let me see. Okay, está la mayoría aquí. I want to thank everyone. Quiero felicitar a todos y a todas for doing a great job. Eh, créanme que esta parece que es la primera vez desde que yo estoy dando este tipo de clases que han completado, <laughs> right? <laughs> Se ha completado todo al 100% antes de iniciar la clase. Very good, excellent. So, felicidades a todos y a todas por ese esfuerzo. Incluso ya les subí las notas a todos de esta semana también. Ok, so everyone finished. So, no tengo que mandar una lista al grupo. Eh, no, eso no va a ser necesario porque ya todos completaron las tareas de esta semana. De esta semana. Ok, so. I want to congratulate you y quiero agregar dos personas más. Bueno, uno no está ahorita, but Marco, uh, usted ya completó ese requisito también de completar todas las actividades de la plataforma. Ok, Marco. Ok, okay thanks. So, su nota final ya la mandé. All right. All right, thank you, teacher. All right, no problem. All right. Así ya cuando estén haciendo el proceso del papeleo, y ven eso, ya está usted completo. Very good. Congratulations. All right. Let me see. Okay, let's continue. So today we're going to do a lot of practice. And that's what this, this, this day is for. That's what this day is for. We're going to do practice 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 things that we have seen and pages that we have not finished okay now to begin para empezar just something brief there is this page okay in unit three where you have mary and rose mary and rose does someone know what page that is? That is page 33. Right? Page 33. La página 33. Déjeme apagar un micrófono aquí que estoy yendo a mucho ruido. All right. Page 33. So you have here 
Espero estén todos en la página 33 en su módulo or at the screen. And we're going to begin this activity, but you're going to do your own. Aquí va a ser sus propios. Okay, ahí hay tres ejemplos. All right. Let me see. Let me poner aquí el... You have here some examples, right? Using ING, pero esto es como, como cuando uno pone una agenda, right? No va a poner todo escrito, sino que nomás la actividad. Right? Algo sencillo aquí, sin, sin estructura, nomás notas, pero siempre utilizando ING. The same way as you see here in these examples. But first, let's read. Let me see. Um, Daniel, Ernest. Yeah, this is Rose. Yes, please. Okay. Hello, Mary. What are the sound activities you are doing? Mm -hmm. this? What are? What are sound activities you are doing this week? Very good. Right. Very good. Thank you. Uh, let's continue with Lisette. Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am singing some play, playrolls. Payrolls. Payrolls. Okay, déjeme pausarla un momento, Lice. Se oye un, como un sonido, como mi. No sé si los demás lo escuchan. Sí, teacher, se okay. escucha. Ay, y como que es como vienen. ¿Ya? No sé, dice. ¿Hable? Vamos a ver. Déjeme conectar los audífonos. Ok, ok, ¿Por? sí, porque se oye como ¡ih! un sonido así, algo ruidosito. Ok, déjeme apagar. Son chicharras. Ok, ya. Yeah. Ok, Conrado, can you read? Continue, please. Um, Hi, Rose. Hello, Mari. Uh, perdón. Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. Okay, bye. For example, Pero, one, no es doing, es doing, doing. Okay, doing. Okay. okay. Well, there, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am singing song. Okay. No, no es uh, singing. Singing es cantando. Signing. Signing. Sign. Es firmando. I am, okay. I am signing some pyros on Tuesday and sing, uh, sending sending. emails on... Sending. 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 Sending emails on Wednesday. And you? Very good. Excellent. Good job. Good job, Conrado. Let me see. Um, Victoria. Um, that okay? That's con S. That's uh -huh. that's okay. I am talking to. Oh. Okay, colleague, <laughs> colleagues, colleagues. All right. And checking reports. Very good, colleagues, colleagues. ¿Qué significa colleagues? Colegas. Colegas, very good, very good, excellent. So that's what it significa colleagues, colegas. Okay, colleagues. yes, yes, very good, very good, Maria. Thank you. Uh, Argueta. Okay, no respuesta. Trinidad, can you continue, please? And who is analyzing the advantage in the company? Okay, analyzing, analyzing, analyzing. the advances, advances. advances. Very good, very good. Conti finish, Trinidad. Peter is very good, excellent. So we have here, and who is analyzing the advances in the company? ¿Y quién está analizando los avances en la compañía? Peter. Peter is, right? That's Peter. 
Okay, so we have here, that's okay. I am talking to colleagues. Estoy hablando con colegas e revisando reportes. Now here, hi Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. Hay muchas cosas que estoy haciendo esta semana. For, por ejemplo, for example, I am signing, signing, estoy firmando, ok? No se van a confundir con esta palabra como singing, como cantando, no. Es signing, signing, firmando algunos, some, payrolls, payrolls, ok? Payrolls es como eh, todo lo que está con los empleados, como la planilla, como lo llamamos, right? The payroll on Tuesday and sending y mandando correo electrónico. Ah, bueno, ya lo demás ya lo saben. Y luego le dice, and you, y tú. Now, as you can see, there are some verbs with ing here. And you have fill in the blanks with events. No, no voy a leer yo. Um, Ramirez. Uh. Fill in the blank with the events you have at your workplace. Okay, very good. So, aquí es fill in the blanks with the events you have at your workplace. Aquí relacionado con su trabajo with your workplace. Now, as you can see, nomás son como que usted lo está agendando, right? No está diciendo como Sachi y, y todo, no, nomás. Signing payroll, firmando planillas, sending emails, mandando correos, analyzing the events, analizando los avances. But these are from the things that Mary, Mary is doing, right? Estas son cosas que Mary está haciendo aquí arriba, right? Mary signing, sending, right? These are things that Mary is doing. Analyzing, como pueden ver aquí. Right? ¿Qué es la número uno? What are some activities Mary is doing this week? Y aquí están. Right? Para que les dé un ejemplo. Now, what you're going to do is talk about. Aquí dice, are you, number two, are you doing some activity described above? Now, para hacer la número dos, antes de ir aquí. This is just brief. This is, are you doing some? No, no, voy a leer yo. Jonathan. Are you doing some of the activities described above? Which one? Which ones? Which ones? Very good. Excellent. Right? Eso significa cuáles en plural. Si le quitamos la S, Jonathan, diría cuál. Okay? Which one? Which ones significa cuáles. Now, alguien aquí, does anyone here do some of these activities que hizo Mary? O que están aquí arriba? Nadie manda correos electrónicos? No? Ok. Nadie revisa los avances de una empresa. No. Ok. All right. Continuamos entonces. All right. Entonces la dos eh, la vamos a anular porque nadie responde. So we're going to do uh, fill, in, fill in the blanks with the events you have at your workplace. Ok. Ahora ustedes van a realizar esto entonces. Aquí sí la van a hacer. All right. So what you're going to do is fill in the blanks with the events you have at your workplace. En su lugar de trabajo. You're going to do four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Okay? Todas estas. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Si lo tienen impreso, pues ahí nomás lo escriben. Si no, I want you to put the number. Van a poner el número 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. I want you to put these numbers. Los quiero con números. All right. Si no han, no han uh, hecho esto impreso, la, el libro. 
You're going to write four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Y los que ya lo tienen en peso, no se preocupen, no más escriban aquí. What, ¿Qué van a escribir? Así como están aquí, unos ejemplos. Como nadie dijo que hace algo de estas actividades, no pueden repetir estas. ¿Ok? So no pueden decir que están haciendo payroll, o mandando correos, o analyzing advances. ¿Ok? No las pueden poner aquí como suyas. Let me see. So van a ser diferentes. You're going to do your own. Remember, using the verb con ing. Signing, sending, analyze. Ok? So you're going to do that. Y le voy a dar. Como nomás son dos o tres palabras cada una. One, two, three, four. Máximo uh, cinco minutos. And you send it when you finish. Sí, la tarea de ayer, ¿qué número le puse? This one is going to be um, está mi papel donde tengo todas las tareas que ustedes me mandan o no me mandaron. Porque algunos no no, no, no las no la mandan. Aquí está. Okay, era a ocho. So this one is going to be okay. A nueve. For today, Friday, July. Okay, you're going to send it to me. Esta me la van a mandar a mí. To to me, okay? Not to the group, but to me. Okay, so you're going to send it to me. You have four minutes left, cuatro minutos. If you don't finish, me lo mandan when you finish. Cuando uh, terminemos la clase, or later on. If you have a question, please ask me. Si tienen una pregunta, una palabra que quisieran ayuda, por favor, aquí estoy para ayudarles. Teacher, una duda. Yes. Inventario, ¿cómo se dice en inglés? Inventario. Ok. Inventory. Inventory. Ok, gracias. Ok. Teacher, si yo me quisiera referir a viñetas. ¿A what? Viñetas. O sticker, sticker sería creo que... Ah, sería yeah, you're, you're talking about la, la del dedo... Uh, yeah, stickers, right? Mm -hmm. Those would be... Stickers. Yes. Or, bueno... Uh, you can, hay otra más apropiada... Se llama, bueno, es que no sé en qué forma me la, me la pasa. You can use a tag. Son, son como que eh, son. viñetas en blanco o sticker en blanco, como de cierta medida, de pulgada por pulgada. Entonces, en sería, cual sería, yo les agrego información. Entonces sería una tag. 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 ¿La puedes ver aquí? Tag. ¿Sí? Ok, así. A tag. All right. Okay. Entonces, y eso... Pero, pero más, más es, es más de una, ¿verdad? Eso serían tags. Ok. Son como tags, pueden ser pequeñitas o grandes, uh -huh. donde llevan números, pueden llevar uh, precios, eh, número de serie, right? O pueden ser grandes, de diferentes colores. They could be different, but they're tags. 
La traducción para eso entonces sería como que viñeta. Eh, uh, yes, uh, right. Okay. Pueden ser a uh, uh, tag de shipping, de receiving, uh, lo, no sé. Right. Okay. All right. Remember, eh, poner una acción, right, Jonathan? All right. Thank you for asking. Y cualquier cosa y pueden ver de examples que están aquí, los ejemplos. Right? No es que van a escribir toda una oración, nomás la acción y como decir, como Jonathan dijo tags, él puede poner a, a, a shipping tags o, I don't know, putting tags, viendo, poniendo viñetas o escribiendo en viñetas, writing on tags. Or, o estampeando como le pone un logo un número ¿eh? estampeando stamping tag Let me see. teacher otra duda yes eh, ¿Cómo se dice o cómo sería lo más adecuado decir torundas? ¿Qué? Torundas, algodón, algodón. Ah, vaya, pues. Okay. Algodón así, en full, en full. Dan, de cierta forma, como algodón. Como, ok, como la, el, 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 el material de, de, que usan para camisa, todo. Algodón, ¿verdad? Right? Material. No, 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 es material para, para curar. Torundas. Es como algodón, pero hecho en bolitas. Ah, ok, que vienen en jarrita que usan los médicos. Yes. Ok, yes. okay. Yes. eso se le llaman, eso tiene su propio nombre. Fíjate. Son gasas. De yeah. cotton. Eh, sí, más o menos como gasas, pero son, pero son, de... son pelotitas. Ok. Sí, yes. All yes. Right. Cotton balls. Okay. Ok. Ah, ok. Esas yes. tienen, yes, en, tienen en frasquito ya de desinfectados, right? Ok. Yeah, the cotton balls. Estas son las que usan en la área de medicina. Cotton balls. Thank you. Ok, no problem. ¿A dónde le vamos a mandar eso, Richard? To me. Send it to me, please. En la palabra que dijo Francisco, él dijo Gaza. ¿Dijo Gaza, Francisco? Yes. Ok, Gaza is gosses. Ok, para aquellos que quieran saber cómo se dice Gaza. Gosses. Así. Gosses. Es una Gaza. Teacher, okay. atender es lo mismo que asistir. Yes, eh, se pueden utilizar en ese contexto también, Trinidad. Assisting or attending. Entonces sí se puede asistir. Sí, puede eh, assisting, asistir como a pacientes o asistir a clases, right? O la otra es atender. La otra sí es. Reuniones. Oh, ok, entonces sería 
uh, attending or okay. assisting. Okay. Las dos puede utilizar uh, Trinidad. Whichever one okay. you prefer is correct. No importa si la uso dos veces. Eh, o sea, el mismo verbo. Mm. Pero en diferentes... If, ok, si va a utilizar dos diferentes okay. acciones, está bien. Está bien. Ok. Ok, contar que son de, sean dos diferentes situaciones. Ok, no problem. Thank you. Ok. Ok, let me see, let's continue. If you don't finish, you can send it to me later. All right, let me see. Ok, si no termina, you can continue later. All right, let's go to the next activity. That was just a little warm up. warm up lo que hicimos anterior. Now this one, remember this one from yesterday? ¿Se acuerdan de esta de ayer? Huh? Yes. yes. All right. Teacher. So we were doing one, two, three, right? One, two, three. Now this one, esta va a llevar dos, right? The question and the answer, right? Esto lo hicimos ayer. Alguien me puede dar para darme un repasadito para que los demás se, se refresquen. Eh, ¿Cuál era la primera? What is the drinking? Ok. Una vez más. What? One more time. Someone repeat. What is the drinking? Very good. Thank you, Francisco. Y cuál, what would be the answer? He's drinking a coffee. Ok, very good, very good. Excellent, right? So, a la pregunta de present continuous y la respuesta también en present continuous, right? What is that drinking? He's drinking, pueden decir una taza de café, right? A cup of coffee. He is drinking coffee. He is drinking lo que vemos aquí, right? Que prácticamente es café. What about number two, Jonathan? Who is playing with the ball? Playing mm. with the ball. Ah, vaya, pues, all right. One more time, Jonathan. Who is playing with the ball? Okay, very good. And what is the answer? Baby Ben is mm -hmm. playing with the ball. With the ball. Every, with the ball. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Good job. So that was number two. Number three. Number three. What was number three from Daniel? Ernesto. Uh, where is Evan sitting? Okay. Uh, Evan is sitting on the chair. Excellent. Good job. Good job. So, esto lo vimos ayer, right? Very good. Good refreshment. Now, four, five, six, seven. Okay, now in this one, me van a dar lo mismo como dieron los otros compañeros anteriores, los tres. You're going to put the sentence complete and the answer, right? Algún, si llegan hasta las 7 que dice hold, es lo que, como sostener. Right. Se le está refiriendo a. Is referring to. Right here. ¿Qué está sosteniendo ella? ¿Una lámpara? ¿Llaves? ¿Qué es lo que tiene su? ¿Lo que está sosteniendo ella? A cup coffee. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Very good. Porque parece que él lo está sirviendo. Él está sirviendo ahí el cafecito. All right. En uso, y uso es the dog. Number five. Aquí estamos como la número dos. Right? Aquí estamos pidiendo quién. Right. Just like number two. Como le hizo Jonathan. Okay. 
you have five minutes. No, esta está un poquito más larga. Le voy, lo voy a retar con unos, let me see, one, two, three, unos six minutes y luego lo voy a poner a uh, in groups for five more minutes para que lo hablen. Okay, because I want you to speak. So ustedes van a hacer la pregunta y la persona le va a responder y viceversa. Ya cuando ya la tengan completa. Solo la hacemos, no se la mandamos. ¿Cómo? Solo se la hacemos aquí o, o se la mandamos. Vaya, en no. esta, eh, en esta, thank you Daniel por preguntar, gracias. En esta, on this one, aquí nomás me van a decir cuando ya termine. Ok, you tell me, teacher and finish, teacher and finish. Y luego, lo voy a poner en breakout rooms para que ustedes mismos hablen la pregunta y la respuesta y intercambien la Y cuando lleguemos a ese punto le voy a decir cómo. So, four, five, six, and seven. A escribir toda la pregunta y toda la respuesta. Complete answer. Full, full, completas. All right? No es que short answer. No, no me va a poner un nombre aquí. Who is sleeping? Ah, Yuso. No. Así como está aquí en el ejemplo que vimos. What is Evan wearing? He is wearing trousers. Complete. If you have a question, remember, si tienen una pregunta, nomás pregúntame. Okay? I will help you. You see, someone has a question. Marco, teacher, I only miss. Okay. No problem. Teacher. I understand, teacher. I understand Marco. No problem. All right, thanks. Thanks, thanks. No problem. Mm -hmm. Alguien, someone, una pregunta, someone, alguien más? Hello, teacher. Me escucha, teacher. Me escucha, teacher.
Any questions? <clears throat> Teacher, una duda. Yes. ¿Cómo se, ¿Cómo se dice, cómo se escribe tareas en English? Ok. Homework. Homework. Gracias. Home, como casa. Homework. I'm going to write it for you. Homework. Estas son tareas como homework, como tareas escritas. No son como los deberes o los, los, las tareas de casa. Ese es otro nombre. Ese es otro. Pero for education, is this one. Para los deberes de la casa, se llaman chores. Ok. That's stupid. All right. Are you finished, Daniel? Yeah, teacher. I have okay. finished. Okay. Any, who else is finished? ¿Qué más ha terminado? Coreas. Okay. Coreas. Daniel. Who else? Jonathan. Jonathan. Efraín. Efraín. Francisco. Francisco. Jessica. Jessica. Victoria. Victoria. Okay, let me see. Okay. Okay. Let me know when you finish. This is the teacher of Terminal. Ramirez? Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Let me see breakout rooms. Let's start breakout rooms. All right, create. Teacher, se lo tenemos que enviar. No, not this one. Esta no. Esta lo van a hacer ustedes in breakout rooms. Lo van a hablar. I want you to speak it. Pero antes que eso, let me see. I'm going to put. I get I am finished. Okay, all right, great. Let me see. Gustavo Trinidad, are you finished? Um, se me fue la señal un momento, pero, pero ya está así. Ok. All right. Gustavo? Todavía me falta uno, DJ. Ok. Sí. Corea, are you finished? Yes, teacher. Okay. All right. Let me see. Estoy aquí haciendo los grupos. All right. So this is what you're going to do. You're going to, let me see. Ejemplo, I'm going to give you the example. Le voy a demostrar cómo va a ser esto. Daniel. Yeah, teacher. Okay, this is 
Vamos a hacer el ejemplo, me and you. All right. So, for example, estamos yo y Daniel en el grupo, right? Imagínense que estamos en breakout rooms, me and Daniel. So, Daniel, hazme la pregunta. La first question. Yeah, la, la primera. Nomás con el ejemplo, what is that drink? La número uno, porque ustedes van a hacer la cuatro, la cinco, la seis y la siete, right? So, para yeah. ejemplo, hazme la número uno, por ejemplo. What is that drinking? Right. Él me la hizo a mí, right? What is that drinking? Y yo voy a responder. He is drinking coffee. Ya miraron. Ahora yo se la voy a hacer a Daniel. Daniel, what is that drinking? He is drinking coffee. Right. Eso es todo. That's it. Okay. So you're going, ahora lo que escribieron lo van a decir, pero lo vice versa. ¿Ya miraron cómo lo hice con Daniel? ¿Alguna pregunta? All right, so you're going to do de esa misma forma, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, four, five, six, and seven. And I'm going to put you in groups of three. Okay, porque no todos salieron con dos, así es que... Eh, Con tres y sale perfecto todo. Así es que, just practice that. Four, five, six, and seven. Yo pienso que ya suficiente tiempo. One, two, three. Breakout rooms. So please join breakout rooms. All right, great. Hello, Flor. Hola. Hola, buenas noches. Hola, hi. ¿Cómo está? ¿Todo bien? Sí, todo bien. Ok, gusto aquí saludarla. Aquí van a entrar. No los va a ver ahorita porque acaban de entrar a breakout rooms. Oh, está bien. Ok, bye. Sorry, uh, oh, um, she's writing in a notebook. Mm, okay. who, who is sleeping? The dog is sleeping on the room on the floor. Where is you sleeping? You um, usel is sleeping on the room. Maybe yeah. The teacher is correct. Mm hmm. On the floor. All right. On the and floor. On the floor. On the floor. Está en oh. el piso. Okay. 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 The carpet le puse. Oh, le puedes poner no. oh, en la carpeta on the carpet too. You can put oh, the carpet. The carpet. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Good observation, Jessica. Jessica miró la carpeta ahí. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, but, remember que carpeta es un poquito universal. Ajá, eso se llama uh, uh, in the rug, R-U-G. I'm going to write it for you para que lo vean. Eso ya que son como las redonditas. Okay. All, right. All right. So it's spelled like this. Let me see. R U G. Rug. Rug. All right. Eso es más específico. More specific. Okay, great. Good job. Remember that Marco is only going to be listening. He no más va a estar escuchándolo. Because he's driving. Está en tráfico ahorita. Que... Okay, so it's just be you two, Jessica and Daniel. Okay? Que ustedes don't know más. Okay. All right. Hello. 
le van a preguntar ahorita al teacher. Teacher. Hey. Hey. Teacher, una pregunta. Eh, el nombre del perro sería Usel o Usel? You can say Uso. Uso. But it could be Usel, right? It could be both. It could be both. No voy a decir, no, es que mira, no. Right? It could be both. Pueden ser los de Uso o Usel. Ok. Ok. Right. Thank you. So, para saber, right? It's like, a, but uh, uh, it, it'll be either one. Yo pienso que una de las dos sería correcta. Si dicen uso or usel, you can. You can use both. Yeah. Okay, teacher. Okay. Había verdad. Preguntado. <laughs> <laughs> All right, any other question? Okay. I believe only that, just that. Okay, great. All right. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, no problem. Okay. In the in the carpet. In the carpet. Mm, in the carpet. Decimos in. In a carpet. Le puse yo. Está dentro de la carpeta. Sobre. Ah, y cómo decimos sobre, on. Gustavo. Entonces, on. On. Yes. All right. On a, on a carpet o on the carpet. Cualquiera de las. I mean, a Trinidad. Cualquiera de, it could be on the carpet or on a carpet, right? Ahí depende, si, ¿cuál es la diferencia? Right. On a carpet significa sobre una carpeta, right? Sobre una carpeta. O sobre la carpeta. Sobre la carpeta. Exacto. Ahí como usted okay. lo quiera eh, decir el artículo, así sería el A o el D. All right? Okay. Teacher, you know, I have a question. Sure, Gustavo. Um, el, estábamos hablando con Trinidad uh -huh. y estaba, yo tenía una consulta con relación a, a la número cuatro. Eh, what is Cindy doing? Eh, ella le colocó Trinidad. Eh, she is uh, doing, doing. doing the homework. homework. Okay. Eh, yo le coloqué en el mío. She is writing the homework. She is, no, she is what? Uh, como ella está escribiendo la tarea. Writing. Okay. Entonces es writing. 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 She is writing the okay. homework. Yeah, you see, you it can say that. Es válido los dos. Yeah, you Doing can say. Writing. Yeah. Ella está haciendo la tarea o tú estás diciendo que ella está escribiendo la tarea? Escribiendo, ajá. Bien, es el. Okay. Yeah. So Muy you bien. can You can do both, right? You can do both. Okay. Okay. Es de la, la consulta. Gracias. Okay, no problem. No problem. Thank you for asking. Bye. No estaba. Ya entré después, entonces no, esas no las he hecho. Sí escuché que dijo de algo, pero Hello. no escuché. Hello. Hello, teacher. All right, great. Teacher. Yes. Fíjese de que a mí se me había olvidado cómo se decía alfombra y decir carpet es malo o no pega. You can, you can say carpet. Porque uno, uno... You can say carpet, pero recuerda, carpeta es más universal, right? Pero hay una palabra específica que se le llama esa que es redondita. No es roof, o sí. Ah, ah va cerca. Rug. 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 R-U-G. R-U-G. Ah, rug. Yes, rug, right? Entonces, roof tampoco es. No, roof, no, roof. A saber, eh, roof es el techo o el nombre de roof. O... <risa> no me puedo estar perdido. O, o es como le hace el perro. Ah, roof, 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 right? Así, mira, rug. Ah, chip, right, rug, right, rug. Right. Mm -hmm. Esa sería la más apropiada porque es una carpetita redondita, right? Y eso tiene su propio nombre. Rug. Y sí, pues, pucha, si le hubiera enviado la oración, le hubiera puesto que el perro dormía en el techo. <risa> ¿Tú deciste roof? ¿Así? Ajá, ajá. 
es, que, es que yo me acuerdo que nos había dado un nombre como que concreto para las alfombras, pero no me acuerdo. Sí, es, es rug. Rug. Está. Ok. All right. All right. Quiero okay. right. okay. eh, ver. Hello, Lisette. Hello, teacher. Ay, la veo aquí sola. What happened? No, es que el Inter me está fallando bastante okay. y no me podía conectar. Lo voy a poner aquí con Room One para que los escuche tan siquiera. Ok, gracias. All right. Where is sí. you, Usel, sleeping? Uh -huh. ¿Dónde es? ¿Dónde está? Ok, viendo... try. No sé. Acordate que Yuso es el perro. Yeah, aquí está el nombre de él, aquí. Yuso es el perro. Right? So, tienes que responder... ¿Dónde está él durmiendo? Where is he sleeping? Where is you so sleeping? Dígame algo. He sleeping en la almohada. Ok. ¿Está dentro de la almohada? ¿O sobre la almohada? Fuera de la almohada. ¿Y cómo decimos sobre? Está, oh. está On. sobre la almohada. On. How do you say almohada? Pillow. 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 All right. So answer the question, Escobar. Where is... Hello? Uh, can you answer the question? Where is you so sleeping? Sleeping. Dice... On the... On... On the... Ok, tiene que poner el verbo. Ok, el ING. Remember the structure, la estructura del present continuous. Repeat, please. Sería if. Puedes usar el nombre de él. It's sleeping. Uso. Usa el nombre. Uso. 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 Uh -huh. Uso. Is. Uh -huh. Lip. Sleeping. Uh, este, uh, uh, está, está durmiendo. No, sobre... English. I want you. I want you to say it in English, Escobar. I want you to say it in English. Okay. You so. Uh -huh. You were doing good. Iba bien. Come on. Dale. You so? You so is sleeping on mm -hmm. on on uh, on uh, how Almada no sé cómo se dice. Okay, pillow, 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 pillow. Ahora dale. Vamos a No. Dice, uh, dice la pregunta, where is he sleeping? Where is he sleeping? Is he sleeping on a uh, pillow? pillow. Yes, so, very good, very good. Excellent, that is correct. Very good, very good. Excellent. Okay, welcome back. Let me see.
be 3.5. Okay. Okay, welcome back, everyone. I hope you practice some speaking. And we are going to do uh, the second, la segunda lista de asistencia. All right. We're going to do the second attendance list. So be ready. Adela Trinidad Gonzalez. Present. Thank you. Adrian de Jesus Machado. Okay, no answer. Alejandro Antonio Ramirez. Present teacher. Thank you. Daniel Ernesto Marquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Gerardo Efraín Mejia. Present. Thank you. Gustavo Alberto Montepec. Present teacher. Thank you. Jonathan Emanuel Franco. Present. Thank you. Jose Daniel Argueta. Present. Okay, thank you. Jose David Rivera. Aquino. Okay, no answer. Jose Santiago Escobar. Hello. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Juan Francisco Rodriguez. Juan Francisco Rodriguez. Present. Okay. Juan Jose Conrado. Present. Thank you. Julio Cesar Merino. Okay, no answer. Marco David Velasquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Misael Rivera Aquino. Okay, no answer. Oscar Edison Coreas. Present. Okay, thank you. Oscar Ramirez. Present. Thank you. Rosa Lisset. Present. Thank you. Victoria Maria. Present. Thank you. Jessica Fuentes. Present. Okay, great. Okay. Let me get over here. <clears throat> All right, let's continue. Let me see. Okay, now, <clears throat> we were doing this yesterday, right? We were doing this yesterday, but we did this in class. Esto lo hicimos en class yesterday, right? Sí. But this part. Uh -huh. What happened? Alguien dijo, tiene pregunta? Okay. Let me see. Daniel. Yeah, sure. Okay. Can you read here letter A, B, and C? Okay. Um, think of some future events of your classmate. Okay. Write five questions to ask your classmates about those events. Those, those. Those events. Take note of their answers. Okay, very good. So here, otra actividad is speaking. Y All right. So here, we're going to put in practice questions, preguntas. ¿Se acuerdan ayer hicimos las WH questions? Right? Incluso hicieron esta pequeña tar tarea. Right? Let me see. Number one. Um, Conrado. Uh, what company are you working uh, for? Very good. What company are you working for? This question, esta pregunta, la van a incluir aquí donde dice number one. Okay. Si ya la tienen en su manual, pues no la tienen que escribir. Right? Si la tienen impresa. Pero si no tienen, lo van a escribir en un cuaderno. Van a poner question y luego one. Esta. What, company, what company are you working for? Sí, sir. The Number. second question is a little, a little confused. No, esta no, esta no la vamos a hacer. Uh, 
Okay, We're, voy a seleccionar la number one here. You're going to put it here. Okay, I'm going to put it aquí abajo. Now, esa sería la única que vamos a utilizar de aquí. Como ejemplo, la vamos a poner aquí. You're going to put it here. Right? So right here where it says questions, it says number one, van a escribir esta. What company are you working for? Okay? Cuando los pongan en breakout rooms, usted le va a hacer la pregunta a, a, cualquiera, a cualquiera con quien esté en su grupo. Y, y ella, es, ella o él le va a dar la respuesta. Okay? For example, ask me the question, please, Francisco. Dígame, Henry, hágame la pregunta number one. Henry, what company are you working? For. For. Very good. Now, Henry, be for, que significa para cuál, right? For. What company are you working for, right? And then I'm going to answer. I am working for Inglés Corporativo and what? For? También. Insafor. Right? So, esa sería mi respuesta, right? Pero cada uno de ustedes tiene su propia. Right? Each of you. What company? ¿Qué compañía? What company are you working for? Right? And I responding. I am working for like I mentioned, English Corporativo, at the same time with Insafor. Right? So, cada uno ten, va a tener su propia comunidad. Ese fue un ejemplo. Juan me preguntó, Francisco me preguntó, and I answer. Right? And then, I'm going to ask him, Francisco, what company are you working for? In my case. Yes, in your case. In my case, I work in Cosasso. I'm working for... For Cosasso. Ok, very good, very good. Excellent. So, así sería la dinámica. Aquí están haciendo preguntas. You're asking questions. Now, you're going to... Aquí dicen cinco. What I'm going to do is ask you to do two and three. No más. One, two, and three. Serían tres no más. Only three. Ya la primera ya está hecha porque ya se la di. Es esta. Right? Espero ya la escribieron todos que la están haciendo escrito. Porque la segunda y la tercera, number two and number three, ustedes las van a crear. Ustedes, propio. Remember the structure. Aquí está la estructura. No van a empezar a escribir como, oh, what is your name? Oh, no, no. Related with work. Relacionado con el trabajo. Right? Related with work. You can put the time. Pueden utilizar el tiempo. Right? What time or when. I want you to do... Um, I want you to create questions. I want you to create questions. Quiero que empiecen a, a crear su propia pregunta. Remember, pensamiento crítico aquí. Tienen que hacer nomás dos y se las van a hacer a su compañero o compañera. Ok. Now, la primera es present continuous, right? Number two and number three. Le voy a dar la opción, le voy a dar la opción que pueden utilizar el presente simple también. Ok. El Daniel ya lo veo que está allá, ya. So here you can do present simple. Right. El presente simple si ustedes quieren. Right. Por ejemplo, um, who is your boss? ¿Quién es su supervisor o your supervisor? Who is your supervisor? Pueden utilizar el presente simple. All right. How many hours? ¿Cuántas horas? How many hours do you work? ¿Cuántas horas trabaja usted? 
What is your schedule? ¿Cuál es su horario? What is your schedule? Okay. Um, which is your favorite day? ¿Cuál es su día favorito de trabajo? Which is your favorite day of work? Right. Sería Monday. el viernes. El día, no, Monday. No. Monday. Yeah, all right. No, or the uh, payday. Right? <laughs> Sunday. All right. all right. So I want you to create. Okay. I want you to create. Quiero que sean creativos ustedes. Ya les di como siete ejemplos ahí. Right. You can use present continuous or present simple. Okay. Aquí es opcional. Ya la primera sí va a ser present continuous. Right. Pero ya la dos y la tres, si ustedes quieren hacerlo presente, sí, pero siempre utilizando WH questions. Right? So, ¿Qué es esto, teacher? Pero ya, yeah, ya lo miraron en el módulo 1. Right? Esto también, WH questions. Y también present continuous. So, ya tienen que estar ya equipados a hacer ambos. So, you have about, le voy a dar unos 3 minutos to create your questions. Yo pienso que ya algunos ya empezaron. Right, so you have about three quest, three minutes, three minutos para hacer dos preguntas más, y lo voy a poner en breakout rooms y esas preguntas, those questions you are going to ask your classmates. Se las va a hacer a sus compañeros de clase, al igual que ellos a usted, o sea, ambos. La primera sí se queda, es un, esa sí se queda fija. What company are you working for? Any questions? Alguna pregunta? Okay. Continue. You have three minutes. Remember, las preguntas van a ir aquí. This section. Only three. Aquí dice cuatro y cinco, pero ¿cuántas van a ser? No más tres. No me van a mandar nada a mí. Okay, this is for breakout rooms. That's those speaking, speaking. Let's
Okay, you should be finished by now. Dos pequeñas preguntitas, no es la gran cosa. So you should be almost finished. Let me see. Daniel, are you finished? Yeah, teacher. Okay. Francisco, are you finished? Yes, I finished. Okay. Juan Jose Conrado, are you finished? Yes, teacher. Okay. Ramirez, are you finished? Okay. Uh, solo vamos a hacer la number two and three. Present. Simple. Era opcional. No es que eso es lo que tenía ah, okay. que era opcional. Era si ustedes querían. All right. Así que yes. use present simple. Dos preguntas, dos pequeñas preguntas. Ok. Solo esas dos. Sí, nomás eran dos, Ramirez. Iban a ser en total. Ah, okay. ¿Cuántas eran en total, Daniel? Three. Three questions. Three. Right. La primera, <laughs> la primera ya se la había dado, que era esta. La segunda y la tercera era de ustedes propios. Y hasta ahí nomás. Ok. Ok, ok. Thanks. All right, no problem. Alejandro, are you finished? Yes, finished. Okay, they said, are you finished? Gustavo, are you finished? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. All right, great. Uh, Argueta, are you finished? Yes, teacher. Okay, thank you. Okay, entonces, everyone finished? Okay. I'm finished, teacher. All right, yes, great. Finish. Okay, now I'm going to put you in breakout rooms. Breakout room. All right, and I want you to ask the questions. Okay, let me re recreate. All right, one, two, three. Breakout rooms. So you're going to ask the questions to your classmates. Teacher, a question. Yes. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice en inglés uh, como el que hace el mantenimiento de un hotel o una empresa? Maintenance. Okay. Maintenance. 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 Maintenance worker. Maintenance worker. Okay. 
Trabajador de mantenimiento. Okay. Jessica is very relaxed. Bien relaxed, okay. Jessica. Yeah, right, chévere. <laughs> All right, great, great. And any other question? Okay. Okay. Mm, bye bye. No. I am, I am working for, y ahí eh, tenés que poner la, la, o sea, el nombre de, la, sí, de sí, tu bro. empresa. Yo ¿Eh? ya vi que entró el teacher. Hello, all right. Hello, yeah. teacher. Hello, teacher. <risa> ya medio le oí ahí que entró. Eh, yo no me acuerdo cómo se dice alcaldía. Ok. Pero sí City, me acuerdo que City estaba... Hall. City Hall. City Hall. City Hall. Very estaba en el, uh, en el manual anterior. Uh -huh. Sí, en el manual ahorita me estaba acordando. City, City Hall. Hall. Yes. Ok. Ok, eh, Juan. I am working in the City Hall. Ok, perfecto. Twelve hours. Twelve hours. How many? Six to six. Six a.m. to six p.m. How many hours? Twelve hours. Twelve hours. Okay, Marco, Marco, con ese. Yeah. Doce hora, hours. Hours. Eso, very good. Twelve hours. Perfect. Bienvenidos. <laughs> ah, thank you. All right, let me see. Yeah, Victoria, yeah. Right there, the, behind Victoria, right? Uh, all right. Welcome. Finally, Welcome, right? Nice. Uh, yeah. Finally, what company are you working? How much time? Sorry? How much time do you have for lunch? How much do you have for lunch? Very good. I have one hour. Okay. Sometimes. Hello, Gustavo. Hello, DJ. Okay. Uh, who were you with? Con quien estabas? Con Argueta, okay. uh, José Argueta. Okay. Okay, te voy a cambiar entonces. We'll go and go. I'm going to put you in another group porque estás solo aquí. All right. Hola. You're by yourself. Estás solo aquí en el, ahorita. Mm. No está Argueta. Okay. All right. Eh, si quiere, le, le pregunto. Y usted ah, me, okay, me contesta. 
Okay, muy bien. Okay. What company are you working for? I work in, in the cooperative. I am or I'm. I'm yes. working in the cooperative. Okay. Okay. La siguiente yo. How long have you been working in the company? <laughs> Very good, Trinidad. Present perfect. Very good. <laughs> okay. Una vez más, porfa. Uh, present perfect continuous. Utilizo ahí Trinidad. Presente perfecto continuo. Very good. Right. Very good. Está bien. Very good. How long have you been working? Le dijo, ¿verdad, Trinidad? Yes. Yeah. How long have you been working for the company? ¿Cuánto, tiene, cuánto tiempo tiene trabajando en la empresa? I'm having uh, one year. One year? Un año? One year. Ah, very good. Entonces, I have been working for one year. I have been working one year. All right. Very good. Very good. Excellent. All right. Good job. Good job. Así van bien. Very good. Okay. What company are you working for? What do you do? What company are you working what? for? Yeah. What company are you working for? Okay, welcome back. Hope you practice a little speaking with your classmates. That is very important for you to be able to speak. Let me see. We're going to do the next activity. Let me compact the pantalla. Yes. Okay, great. Next part. This is in in your module. I mean, in your uh, in your book. You know, see it in your manual. What so is this? Uh, your manual. What page is that? Can someone tell me the page? Thirty-four. What is it? Thank you. 34. Yes, that is correct. Page 34. Page 34. Right. Page 34. Now, this is a reading activity. I guess lectura, reading comprehension, right? Reading comprehension. So I'm going to ask volunteer. Vamos a ver voluntarios aquí o voluntaria. Who wants to read? What you're going to do is, prácticamente, basically, you have an article, un artículo, an article, about different things, okay? Ya son diferentes. And you have some questions, 
at the bottom, there are five questions, okay? True or false? Verdaderas o falsas. You have five. I want you, who wants to begin reading? ¿Quién quiere participar para leer? The first one, organize yoga classes. Marco. Go out, teacher. Okay, Marco. One, organize yoga class. Classes. Classes. If you work in an office and your employees are sitting at computers every day, then underestimate. Okay, underestimate. Underestimate the impact yoga could have on their attitude. Uh, I see, it's okay. Okay, yes, you're doing good. Attitude and outlook. Outlook. Okay. Yoga can help. Uh, outlook. 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 Yoga can help can help alleviate stress stress uh, alleviate 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 the stress calm the mind release tension improve brain function and lift mood mood okay what Need. boss will okay. want mood 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 Voy a ampliar, permíteme. Right. Mood, mood. And li life mood, mood. Yes. What both will want does. Wouldn't. Does, wouldn't. Wouldn't. ¿Cómo es? Wouldn't. 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 Yes. Wouldn't. Ah, yeah. Wouldn't want to those outcomes. Okay. Those. 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 This is basically mm -hmm. uh, just reading comprehension. Okay. Very good. Very good. So we have here, it says organize yoga classes, organizar classes de yoga. Now we have some vocabulary here, here right? Alguien sabe que es underestimate? Underestimate? It says employees. No, de, desestimar. Yes, subestimar, right? Yes. Subestimar. Is, yes, exactamente, right? El impacto de yoga que puede eh, tener en su, en su... What is attitude? Actitud. Actitud. Very good. And outlook. What is outlook? In... Outlook. What is outlook? I don't know. Okay, does someone know? Outlook. Mm. Como el punto de vista, eh, the outlook, eh, la, la actitud y el, como el ambiente, el panorama, eh, lo, lo, lo cambia. Ok. So, está hablando de yoga. Como su comportamiento, algo así. Yes, it's related with comportamiento y, y, y el ambiente, la perspectiva, el panorama. Forma de pensar. Yes, exactly. Yoga can help. Yoga can help alleviate, alleviate, es alleviate stress. Alleviate. La yoga ayuda a aliviar el estrés. Very good, aliviar, right? Alleviate stress, calm the mind. What is mind? Mente. La mente, right? Calma la mente, release tension. Relaja la tensión. Very good, improve brain function. Right. Y dice también yeah. mejorar la fun función del cerebro. And lift mood. What is lift? Lift. Lift. Y levantar el ánimo. The mood. Ok. Qué, cua, yeah. qué jefe no quisiera esos tipos de resultados. Right. So this is organized yoga classes. Then we have celebrate birthdays okay escobar go ahead do you wanted to participate okay to to celebrate 
celebrate day. Celebrate, celebrate. Celebrate bir, birthday. Mm -hmm. Birthdays, con la S. Si ven la S, pronuncia la palabra. Very good. Birthdays. Very good. You don't have, just, have to. Huh? Just. Just. Just have to really rely. Rely on bosun. Business. Or bosun. Business. Bosun. Business. 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 Mm -hmm. Games to bots boost Mor morale 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 simple chim chim Sim uh -huh. simple or simply simply uh, simply acknowledging no acknowledging 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 a special occasions occasion occasions can have a big impact very good it shows or shows sí. your your thing that you that you care about thing as people not units as employees get everyone 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 to sing a car to sign 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 okay. to sign a car have cake, cake on once one a month or same simply mm -hmm. bo by ten around around mm -hmm. continue seguimos uh, okay yes. up of coffers mm -hmm. each time someone 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 your, someone no, someone someone no no some, no someone no someone 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 S someone in your team has has a birthday very good escobar very good thank you Good effort. Buen esfuerzo. Very good. Okay, next one. Alejandro, teacher. Okay, Alejandro, go ahead. Paintball. Three paint, paintball. Give your employees an opportunity. Opportunity. Opportunity to lift up some steam. Be by. By organizing a day of. Uh, organizing. Organizing. By organizing a day of paintball. Okay. Day, day, day. A day of paintball. Very good. Simple. Simply. Simply getting out of the office can, can work wonders. Very good. For a staff morale. Morale, morale. For staff moral. Very good. Watch out though. Very good. As the boss. As the boss. Mm -hmm. You're going to be a prime target. Very good. Very good. Excellent. Number four. Who wants to read number four? Alguien más que no participado? Okay, voy a seleccionar a alguien entonces. Let me see. Trinidad. Yes, Trinidad. Guess who? Ask every, everyone to bring a childhood. Child, childhood. Childhood photo of themselves and put them uh, are up on a bar and then get every everyone to put their best guesses forward on each one. Read a bite or 
of EC okay. lies. It's a bit, bit, bit. It's a, it's a bit of EC lies. Here the form that will definitely. Okay, definitely, definitely. Definitely help like spirit while offering plenty of humor along the way. Okay, humor, humor. Humor. Yes, very good, along the way. Very good, excellent. Y humor es igual como el español, el humor, right? Very good, thank you, Trinidad. So we have here four different articles, cuatro en una, four in one, and you have one, two, three, four, five. Now here, let's look at the question. Number one, Coreas. Yoga has an important effect on employees. Okay. Very good. Number two, um, Victoria. Yoga rela releases. 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 Release. Okay. Yoga releases tension. Okay. Tension. 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 Okay. Yoga releases tension, but it but but but. <laughs> But it okay. does not call the meal. Mind, mind. Mind. Very good, very good. Good effort. When is fue? So very good. Let me see. Yoga releases tension, but it doesn't calm the mind. Okay, number three. Who wants to read number three? Jessica. Juan Jose, teacher. Okay, Juan Jose, luego Jessica. Go ahead, Juan Jose. Okay, number three. Based say on the based, reading based. Uh, based okay. Based on the reading, a special occasion are not occasions, important. La S, occasions. Occasions. Okay. Basing on the reading, a special occasions are not important. Okay, mucho mejor. Very good. Right? Based on the reading. Very good. You see this right here? Based on the reading, special occasions are not important, right? Let me see, Jessica. Workers can play paintball inside the office. Okay, very good. Francisco, number five. Sorry. Okay, no problem. Childhood. Boros can offer them boils. Okay, very good, very good, very good. Childhood photos can offend employees. Offend significa offender, right? So look at these questions. What do you think? Después de leer todos los artículos aquí, yoga has an important effect on employees. Do you think, basado en la lectura, que la yoga causa unos efectos importantes a los empleados? Do you think it causes... True. 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 Yes, right, that is true. So number one, van a poner true. La vamos a hacer juntos. Okay, we're going to do it together. Okay? Se las iba a dejar de tarea, pero no. I think you did good. Hicieron muy bien en las, en las otras tareas. De... Así que no les voy a dejar tarea. Today. So disfruten el fin de semana when we finish. Okay, recuerden, no hay tareas. Si alguien me pregunta, no hay tareas. For today. La única que estaba es la que hicimos temprano. Si no la han enviado, pues esa sería la única. Number two. Yoga releases tension, but it doesn't calm the mind. Yoga, eh, o sea, hace soltar la tensión, right? Pero no calma la mente. False. Okay. ¿Quién más dice que es false? False. Yeah. Es false, right? Es falso porque aquí dice que. Eh, Según bueno, la escritura, pero, calma, la, calma la mente. Y ahí está diciendo que. Que no calma. Pero no, no calma la mente. Right, so es false. 
All right, it's false. 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 Okay. Number three, based on the reading. Okay. Y como puede ver Jessica, mire, mire aquí una, una palabra aquí, Jessica. Reading, right? Esto es un sustantivo basado en la escritura. Aunque es con ing, pero no es, con, no es un verbo. Okay. Basado en la escritura. Based on the reading, que es como una materia. Como spelling. Algunos han tomado una materia en la escuela que se llama spelling. ¿Sí? ¿No? Okay. El letrear. Yeah, there you go. Right? So we have based on the reading. Basado en la escritura. Una lectura. Special occasions are not important. What do you think? Ocasiones especiales no son importantes. ¿sí? False. False, right. That is correct. It's false. It's false, right. False. Let me see. What about number four? Workers can play paintball. Ya estamos hablando de paintball, right. Workers can play paintball inside the office. Ellos pueden jugar este keep. ¿Saben qué es paintball? No. Yes. Okay. Paintball is whenever you go out y se empiezan a tirar así, ta, 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 con bolas de, de tinta, de pintura. Right. Right. So, so is that true? Que pueden hacerlo dentro de las oficinas? False. False. False, right? Yeah, that is false, right? Let me see. Aquí, incluso aquí dice getting out. Fuera de la oficina. Lástima. Yeah. <laughs> Let me see. All right, what about... <laughs> Lástima. All right, what about number five? Childhood photos can offend employees. Right? Childhood photos. Eh, basado en la lectura, right? Aquí dice que ofende a los empleados. Is that true? Basado, basándonos en la lectura. What do you think? Is it true or false? Fotos de la niñez eh, ofenden a los empleados. Aquí está la lectura. What do you think? Is it true or false? True. Okay. No, no, no. False. False. False, right? Porque aquí está diciendo que todos traigan qué? Childhood una, photos. Una foto. De ellos, de la niñez. Y que los pongan en dónde? En una board. Una board es como oh, un cuadrito okay. donde uno pega fotos y los lleva al lugar, right? Ok, so... True, it'll be false. Right? It'll be false. So the first one is true. Number two, false. Let me put the microphone. Number one is true. Number two is false. Number three, false. Number four, false. And number five is false. Okay, great. All right, class. So we did a bunch of practice, speaking, reading, writing. Tengo que hacer de todo hoy, right? I'm going to do the final. Let's see. The final attendance. Okay, let me see. Okay. Adela Trinidad González. Present. Thank you. Adrian de Jesús Machado. Okay, zero. Alejandro Antonio Ramirez. Present teacher. Thank you. And Daniel Ernesto Marquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Gerardo Efraín Mejía. Present. Okay. Okay, let me see. Tengo aquí una, una notificación. Let me see. Okay, Efraín. Hello, Efraín. Try. Yes. 
eh, try not to miss, ok? Trata de no faltar eh, next week. Yeah, but yesterday was for the same mm -hmm. the day on Wednesday. Yes, ok. I'm just... Went to the front. Yes, I understand. Si, sí, te llamaron hoy, verdad? Yes, I explained yeah. him. Yeah, ahí estoy viendo la notificación. All right, let me see. Yeah, I was looking, estaba mirando ahí, like, yeah, ya tienes como dos, dos, ahí, al más o menos así. Pero estoy mirando, I'm looking at your percentage, estoy mirando tu porcentaje. Okay. And that's good? So, uh, I have a little uh, problem. Yeah, so, try not to miss, okay, Efraín? Yeah, I know. All right, let me see. Gustavo Alberto Montepec. Present, teacher. Okay, thank you. Jonathan Emanuel Franco. Present. Thank you. Jose Daniel Argueta. Okay, no, no answer. Jose David Rivera Aquino. Jose David Rivera Aquino. Okay. Cero. I, Jose Santiago Escobar. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Juan Francisco Rodriguez. Present teacher. All right, thank you. Juan Jose Conrado. Present. Thank you. Julio Cesar Merino Gonzalez. Julio Cesar Merino Gonzalez, okay. Cero. Marco David Velázquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Misael Rivera Aquino. Misael Rivera Aquino. Okay. Cero. Oscar Coreas. Present. Thank you. Uh, Oscar Ramirez. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Rosa Lisset. Present. Thank you. Victoria Maria Vasquez. Present. Okay, thank you. And finally, Jessica Beatriz. Present. Ok, el único que se queda hoy es Misael Rivera, aquí no, y no está presente. So, I wish you the best, que pasen un feliz fin de semana, take care, have a great weekend, and thank you for doing all the homework. No tienen actividad. Good night. De forma. Good night, everyone. Take thank care. You, bye bye. Ok. Bye. Good night, teacher. Ok, bye. Good night, good night teacher. Good night. Hello, Juan. Hello, Hi. Hello. You can stay. Si quieres quedarte unos minutos, you can. Uh, in, if you have any questions or if you have any doubts. No, I don't know. I, I, I hear the, the last room for a week. Okay. Okay, great. Because... Uh, Okay, then if you have any, do you have any questions? No hay pregunta. Really, I don't. No, I no tengo realmente. Okay, you don't have any. Okay. All right, then. I'll see you next week, then, Juan. See you, Mr. Okay, you. okay. Thanks. No problem.